Holy cow. <laughs> to my beautiful wife on our wedding day, I love you so much and I have been getting so anxious for this day. Whenever I start thinking about it, I get butterflies in my stomach and it makes me smile because you are going to be my wife. Finally, I don't have to say I'm waiting for my fiance anymore. I can just say I'm waiting for my badass wife. <laughs> I am ready to marry you and officially start our life together. I'm ready to laugh with you and feel embarrassed while we are the center of attention today. I want to dance with you and eat wedding cake with you. <laughs> I want to sing with you and take pictures with you and maybe even sneak out and make out with my new wife. <laughs> even those little bells will be ringing all night. I can already hear them. It's almost time we got this, babe. I love you, Jordan. My soon-to-be Monty. <laughs> that was cute. <sighs> to my groom on our wedding day, the day I've been dreaming about since I was a little girl is finally here. And as I sit here reflecting on the past six and a half years that has led us to this moment, my heart is so full. We get married today. I want to begin by saying that I love you with all my heart. You entering my life at a time when I believed love no longer existed. But to my surprise, you showed me I just hadn't found the right love yet. You are the very best part of me, and I look forward to the life we're going to build together. The greatest decision of my life was saying yes to becoming your wife. And I cannot have asked for a more compassionate, loving husband, man, handsome man, to call you my husband. I can't wait to be your wife. I love you. I'll see you soon. Love, you're soon to be Mrs. Monte. I love you, Jordan. Jordan, I cannot think of anyone more beautiful to be standing across from. When thinking about my earliest memories of you, I never would have imagined that one day I'd be standing in front of you, ready to commit my love and my life to you. Even with your weird habits that I've come to adore. <laughs> from this day forward, I promise to always put your needs before others, as well as my own. I promise to always remain loyal. And devoted to you. I promise to give you my heart and soul and love you unconditionally. I can't wait to see what this life has in store for us and all that we can accomplish together. You will always have me on your side and no matter the challenge, I'll follow you down. You are my one and only. I love you. Ethan, as we stand here today in front of all of our loved ones, I have a million different emotions. I have great amounts of joy and happiness, but most importantly, I have the deepest, most powerful amount of love I've ever felt. I vow to be the one to build you up and show you your worth, even when you may doubt yourself. I promise to be your biggest supporter, 
and all decisions except for leaving your dirty socks all over the house. <laughs> I can't support that. <laughs> I have vowed that even on our worst days, we will get through whatever is thrown at us. And lastly, I vow to love you unconditionally until the end of time. I look at you and I see my best friend and the love of my life. And I cannot wait to see what our perfectly imperfect life is together. And I love you with my whole heart and soul. There's two are forever. Uh, the power vested in me by the state of Michigan and by the Church of Universal Life Church, I pronounce you, Ethan and Jordan, as husband and wife, lawfully wed before God. You may kiss the bride. A big kiss. a big kiss, not a necking session. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it is with great pleasure and honor and such a blessing that I officially present to you Mr. and Mrs. Ethan and Jordan Montel. your guys' love for each other grow over the years into the beautiful relationship that it is today. May you continue to love each other more and more each and every day. May your marriage fulfill you in every single way. And most importantly, may your dreams come true because you both deserve nothing less. I remember when you first met Ethan and brought him to meet everyone. And I honestly knew either that he was gonna be one of the biggest and major heartbreaks of your life or that he was going to be the man that you marry. And thankfully, he was the man that she married. I got to know the both of them over the same course of time. That is the test, time. They've already given time to run for its money, so I have no doubts in my mind that they are perfect for each other. To eat and enjoy. When, I, when we were living together, when I seen you guys hanging out all the time, it made me feel like this is what I want someday. So thank you for making me a part of your day and I love you both. As a parent, when your child starts dating and they're bringing someone home for the first time, God could not have brought a greater man to my child. I just want you guys to know that I love you both. You love you both. And we're so happy you're part of our family. I won't miss your stuff all over my house, though. <laughs>